Welcome back to this channel for practice problems for actuarial exams. My name is Krzysztof Ostaszewski. You can find information about me at smarturl.it forward slash Jedi. My advice on how to pass actuarial exams is at smarturl.it forward slash pass. This video channel is at smarturl.it forward slash pass actuarial exams. Here you have information about online seminars and study manuals for exams P, FM, IFM, and LTAM that I offer. I direct the actual program at Illinois State University. You can find information about it at smarturl.it forward slash actuary. If you would like to offer a tax deductible donation to support our students, please go to smarturl.it forward slash help ISU actuary. Here's the problem for today. For exam LTAM, you are given Q60 as 0.01 using interest rate of 5%. A um, 60 colon angle 3 is 0.86545 using interest rate of 4.5% instead of 5%. Calculate the same quantity, A60 colon angle 3. And here's the solution. So using I equal to 0.05%, um, that A60 colon angle 3, which we know to be 0.86545, that's equal to Q60 over 1.05 plus 1 minus Q60 times Q61 over 1.05 squared plus 1 minus Q60 times 1 minus um, Q61 over 1.05 cubed, because note that this is an endowment insurance, not pure endowment, but endowment. So it will pay at the end of the third year no matter what. But we are given that Q60 is 0.01, and using that we obtain 0.86545 to be 0.01 over 1.05, plus 0.99, which is 1 minus 0.01, times Q61 over 1.05 squared, plus 0.99 times 1 minus Q61 over 1.05 cubed. And that is an equation uh, in which we can... Uh, multiply everything out by 1.03 cubed and get what you see here, which I will, um, I just corrected it a bit because it was a bit too small, and and we just solved this equation for Q61, and Q61 turns out to be approximately 0 0.01700114. And we go back to the basic formula for uh, this uh, three-year endowment, A60 colon angle 3, is Q60 over 1.045, this time, not 5%, but 4.5%, uh, plus 1 minus Q60 times Q61 over 1.045 squared, plus 1 minus Q60 times 1 minus Q61 over 1.045 cubed. And we plug in uh, Q60, Q61, 1 minus Q60, 1 minus Q61, do the calculation, we obtain approximately 0.8777672, which is answer D. Please remember this is copyrighted material. The problem itself belongs to the Society of Actuaries. The solution is mine. Good luck in your studies, and good luck on your test.